the first question was, were you diagnosed with type 1 bipolar? At the time, at the time when this happened to me, we didn't have type 1 or type 2. There was no that distinction. That's a, a distinction that came later. So I can't say that. But from what I can see of the, my symptoms, it would fit with, with, it, with a type 1. So for I, those who, to, just yeah. to jump in, for those who want to know the difference, type 1 is where people have severe episodes of mania and then the depression. Uh, and the criteria is you have to have mania for at least seven days, most of the time for at least seven days, or it has to be so severe that you need immediate medical attention. Um, whereas type two is uh, where people go into what they call hypomania, where it's not quite as severe or, or intense, but obviously still impacting the person and then the depression. So it's a question of severity of the type one symptoms, which in some cases like this one here, can the mania can get to the point of psychosis. Hi, I'm Emmy Golding, Director of Psychology for the Workplace Mental Health Institute. We hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. We have more and more videos being released each week. So when you subscribe, you'll get a notification letting you know when a new one's just been published. So make sure to hit that subscribe button and don't miss out on this vital information for yourself, your colleagues and your loved ones.